Hey everyone. What's up guys, unofficial MCU here. Hope you're all doing well, and in this video we have an update and new reveal into the regards of the Marvel Studios Disney Plus Wonder Man show. We're gonna go ahead and hop right on into it. A new forthcoming MCU project for Disney Plus, that there being Wonder Man, will fall under the studio's new Spotlight banner. And for those of you that may be unfamiliar with exactly what the Spotlight banner is, this was something that was newly revealed and announced by Marvel Studios and Disney themselves as well just a couple of weeks ago. Pretty much what it is it's just a new category that they're going to be placing certain projects whether it's a Disney Plus show or if it's a movie of pretty much the overall premise of whatever project per se it is exactly doesn't overly connect to every other Marvel Disney Plus project or or movie for that matter there as well like those are projects that you can just kind of casually watch you don't have to have seen like every other Marvel movie or Disney Plus show to exactly understand with what's going on and I think that's a great idea and a, it's something that a lot of fans can Kind of honestly need uh, with the speed and uh, that the, the MCU is kind of unraveling at especially it only looks to get bigger and bigger which don't get me wrong by any means is absolutely amazing so after 15 years at this point there's no denying that the Marvel Cinematic Universe has a significant amount of established continuity with over 30 films and multiple seasons of television at this point it can be tough for newcomers to the franchise to find that perfect jumping on in point this is why Marvel had recently debuted a new headlining for specific offerings as I had mentioned, Marvel Studios Spotlight. This new category contains MCU projects that don't have a ton of continuity baggage and can easily be picked up and watched without any prior knowledge essentially. The first of the Spotlight shows is actually Echo, which is going to be releasing on January 9th of next year, all five of its episodes, and the next one has already been confirmed and revealed, that there being Wonder Man. Recently according to Deadline.com, the MCU's Wonder Man show will be a part of the Marvel Studios Spotlight Initiative. This marks the second MCU show to be announced as a Spotlight series after Echo. The Wonder Man Disney Plus show was in production prior to the Hollywood strikes earlier this year, and it will reportedly resume its filming shortly after Thanksgiving break, despite previous claims that the show had actually been scrapped. It is still moving forward and still happening, and probably for all that we know is that they're actually still working on it right now. So this year all being said, how will the Wonder Man Disney Plus show still have its MCU ties? With the announcement that Wonder Man is a Marvel Studios Spotlight series, it is expected to be largely quite a standalone show, but that doesn't mean that it won't be set within the MCU of course. It is both Echo and every other Spotlight banner show is, is set within the MCU of course. It's been previously indicated that Wonder Man will serve as sort of a Hollywood satire to a point. This is appropriate given the fact that Wonder Man himself, Simon Williams, was an actor before he had gained his superpowers within the comics. And so, who else is an actor in the MCU? None other than Bed Kingsley's Trevor Slatley, who made his presence known in the 2013's Iron Man 3 after resurfacing in Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings eight years later. In a frequently drunk, washed-up, Thanos Pan was kind of confirmed to be making an appearance in Wonder Man, firmly connecting the show to the wider MCU as well. The intent of Spotlight Projects doesn't seem to be a cordon off the characters and exclude them from any larger canon. After all, Echo is a direct tether to the events of Hawkeye, a spinoff to a spinoff in a way. Anyway guys, this year all being said, let me know all of your thoughts and opinions in the comment section down below. I would love to hear what you guys are all thinking and looking forward to seeing most. Thanks so much for watching today's video. Of course, this has been an official MCU. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Have a great one, guys. Peace out.